blunt weapons usually build up more. I feel like the dancer was meant to build up stagger though. Like bunches of fast attacks to build up stagger. At least I've like read in the description. I'm wrong though. Yeah, builds up immobilization. We'll see. Yeah, I think I, just, I got greedy there. Need, need to be patient. Need to be patient. Oh, he heard me. Ugh, I didn't want to do damage. Could be best up stats too. Dagger! Enemy stamina to fall? Okay. Stamina to fall up. Out of grenades. I hit him with. I only had two grenades, and I used them both messing around. So yes, that's where I'm. That's where I'm at right now. That's okay, we're getting it lots of practice. Look on the bright side. Might be. I need to double check. Alchemical. It's not in my. I feel like it might be used for crafting. Because I don't see it as something I can equip on my belt. Yeah, I'm not sure what that is for. Why have I got an explosive grenade? I didn't realize that. All right, let me let me do this. Let me put this there. Oops.
provides a tiny amount of anima essence. Okay. So I go into sneak mode as soon as I target him. Cool, dude, not cool at all. Oh, I blocked that. Man, I did not. There's a downward strike and a side strike. What the hell is that? Gotta climb over the first mountain. And after it's done, it's all, I'm sure it's all, I'm sure it's all downhill. Right? Right. Okay. So I guess if when my bar turns white and drains, I have to eat quickly. And if I can do that, I can recover stamina. So as soon as I hit go into overheat mode, I have to hit E. And then I get stamina back. But if I do that too many times, I think I take damage. Use for skills, okay. It didn't even do any damage to it, did it?
No. All right, yeah, the the stamina system is weird. That's what's messing me up at the moment. Because, like, there's an extra layer to it. I'm not sure. It let's you recover some stamina. Yeah, that's... Hmm. But the faster you can react, the more stamina you can recover, which is going to be... going to be something. Also, I think there's another bot behind that wall I can ag aggro accidentally, which is not cool. That was much better. That was much better. And a module key. You obtained a module key. Aegis has several slots for modules that augments her stats and alters the behavior of certain mechanics. The slots have uh, levels that allow Aegis to equip, equip uh, increasingly powerful modules. To unlock a slot with a module key you just obtained, go to the upgrade menu. All right. Note, you can equip modules anytime from the Aegis module menu. Is there another robot back here? There is. What a dick. Waiting for me. I'm pretty sure I aggroed him and the boss at the same time. I first walked in here and I was not. Not think that was cool. All right, uh, equipment modules. How do I use a module key? Select. Not I have a key. Huh. Okay. Weird.
Maybe it's through upgrades. Yeah, I mean, I got to do the upgrade menu. Yes, okay. So I guess that, that menu is just for equipping, and this is for upgrading. Requires three keys to upgrade. Interesting. So we can increase the levels of our module slots. We had like to unlock a second one though. Because I have another module I can use. Okay. Let's see. Power durability. We need a, a thousand essence to upgrade. Bigger engineering agility. So right now I'm agility based bigger. I would like I would like one into bigger. And one into durability. Let's do that. So I have a thousand, eleven hundred left. Yeah, <laughs> just it's better safe than sorry. Do do. All right. So weapons. Oh, sorry. We can upgrade our man. We need a lot of essence, don't we? We need bronze. Okay. Boutique, I guess I can buy stuff. I have 126. Can I buy anything? Oil vials. 14 of those. Eh, just save it. Just save it. Nothing to sell. Nothing to buy. Okay. Equipment. Did he drop anything? Guess not. Just just essence. Okay. Okay, don't think I'm just, yeah. I don't know if they're... They're actually selling weapons in this thing? They just have... They just have... Boutique. In boutique? Where is it? Equipment. Oh, there it is. No, it's just the... Just the starting weapons. Modules, equipment, modules. Want to reduces internal damage of rapid cooling. Okay, better than nothing. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see what kind of weapons we get. I like the robots are dumb. <laughs> She's a dumb robot. Okay. The chests? Really? Game, you're gonna... It's not cool. It's a, it's a very shiny box. Not to be able to open. I don't, I don't like boxes you can't loot or smash. A shield musket. You've acquired a new weapon. She 
shield musket. Doesn't move shield. Weapon has a retractable shield, but is deployed. Aegis can be protected and only feels impact from enemy attacks. So it does frost damage with alchemical affinity. <laughs> alchemical hand cannon and afflictions. You acquired a hand cannon. I think it's literally a hand cannon because it comes out of her hand. Just like uh, enemies' weapons, Aegis' own weapons can cause alchemical damage, flame, frost, and fulmination when she uses alchemical capsules for each such attack. Alchemical damage fills a gauge which, uh, when full triggers an affliction, which lasts until the gauge is depleted. Flame ignites target, causing continuous damage. Can be uh, extinguished by dodging frost. Can fall by attacking. Fulmination electrocutes target with each hit taken, causing additional damage. So I need to use an elixir for that one. I need to attack. If I'm frozen, I need to dodge if I'm on fire. Okay. Interesting. That's okay. Ooh. Yeah, I see the guns using the capsules. Yeah. What kind of range are we talking about here? Interesting, so I can freeze him with the gun and then just go to town, huh? You area the lantern. Blocked. Hi there. Go. Why would you why would you design one of these like that? Oh, you breathe fire. Interesting. Okay. Necessary to make it look like a whatever that is. is. That loot in there, or is it just a reflection? Just a reflection. Yeah, I'm not a fan of the overheat mechanic. I don't know. Feels clunky. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm clunky. I don't know. Ooh, we got a coat and a hat. Uh, let's see. Worst balance, worst frost resist. More, en more endurance, though, plus more armor. What does balance do? Defense? Miss view. Balance. Armor, flame resistance. Maybe that's stagger? Stagger resistance? I don't know. But I like the I like the endurance. Balance is anti-stagger, okay. Stylish. Oh, let's see, more endurance, less loot. Oh, wow, that, holy crap, why does that have so much armor? <laughs> that's, 
What is, what is that hat made out of? It has to be, that has to be a bug, right? Yeah, I'll put that on. Holy crap. All right, I assume I cannot go out this gate yet. Blocked. Okay. Step right up, step right up one at a time. How common those oil vials are going to be. Watch now. What is up there? Another one of those Naga looking guys in a chest. Okay, so there is. That's weird. I wonder if they'll hill block it. I cannot climb unless I'm going to be disappointed. Ooh, a nemesis clause. Finding one's way. You found a compass. You can assign a compass to a quick access belt so you can use it at any time to see the way to your destination. Open. Okay. And some claws. Access belt, compass. Equipment. Nemesis claws, physical. Agility affinity. Counterattack. Any parry that is timed just right reverses the enemy attack 